hey what's up guys i'm back here with a new video and this video is going to be about how to use an android device as secondary monitor for your pc or mac so without any delay let's get started i'm starting a new series on the channel that is droid hack in this series i'll show you multiple tricks and hacks on android device Okay, before getting started, if you haven't subscribed to our channel already, then hit that subscribe button right now because you will love the content on our channel and hit that bell button to get notified whenever I upload a video. The cool thing about this trick is that it does not require any root access to work. First of all, go to your play store on your Android device and download iDisplay application. Once you've done that, then go to your computer and go to this website in the description down below and download the iDisplay software for your Windows or Mac. Once you've done that, just open it up and select the language and choose I agree, then just click on next, next, next. When the installation is complete, it will ask you to restart your system. Just, then just click on finish, your PC will be restarted. Once your PC is restarted, just double click on the iDisplay icon on your desktop and it will be started as you can see in the system tray. Now once you have done that, on your Android device just open the iDisplay application which you have downloaded earlier. Now we have our PC listed here. And note that for this both your PC and Android device should be connected to the same Wi-Fi or also you can use your USB cable. Now once you see your PC listed on your Android device, just click on it and on your PC you will get a message saying that do you want to allow connection for this device, just click on always allow. And that's it, your Android device is successfully connected to your PC as secondary screen. If you want to ensure it is working properly. Just go to your PC display settings and there you can see two displays running at the same time. Now I will show you a short demonstration how this works. Just open anything like my computer or media player. If you hold it and drag it, you can see that window on your Android device. If you don't want this secondary display, then just exit the iDisplay from your system tray on your desktop and as well as from your Android device. And that's it. If you still have any questions, don't forget to put them in the comment section down below. And hit that like button if you like this video and I will see you in my next video.